Hi, um, I hope you're well. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Francesca Shali. Um, it's currently 8.40. I'm up so early today because I have an appointment, um, a salon appointment and a lash appointment as well. And uh, I'm supposed to be there at 10. So I'm praying there's no traffic. And I hope I'm going to get you on time. I'm going to get there on time. It's been so long since I woke up so early. So I think I'm still lowing yeah but anyway this is my outfit of the day this hoodie uh brown and black hoodie that i got from sheen of course my favorite pair of jeans and uh, some batangomas you can never go wrong with batangomas and this bucket hat that i've just thrown on i don't know what is wrong with my hair yani let me not say i don't know what is wrong with my hair but my hair has not been feeling it like i've not been feeling my hair lately um i i don't know I really don't know so um i want to go and breed it at least um so that i can it can get some break like you know i have done it and undone it um twice in less than two, it's not even been that i think in three weeks three, yani, i don't know so um it feels quite brutal and weak so um i want to break it up so that i can take care of it properly like um yeah i hope i'm making sense still very early for me anyway let me take breakfast and then um we head to town I realized I haven't spoken ever since I started vlogging. Today is Thursday though, and I don't know how this video is going to be like because I don't want it to be too long and I don't want it to be too short. I just want it to be there, right? It's making sense. Like I want it to make sense. So I really don't know how it's going to turn out. I really don't know. But anyway, today is Thursday. I don't know how I've said that. Two days after getting my hair and nails done, um, I'm so glad I I, I did that. I, I was longing for that honestly it's been long since i actually had maybe they don't know the difference between a manicure and a pedicure like put my legs in <laughs> put my legs in that thing and got scrubbed it felt so so good but anyway this is how the hair turned out this is two days after getting it done it still looks amazing and i love the fact that um it's crochet i do want anything that would like um tamper with my hairline because i feel like my hair is quite damaged now i don't know why 
um it was really dry it was really brutal brittle and it was breaking quite a lot so i wanted something that would not like wouldn't make it any worse and the lady advised me to get this done because it's crochet and it's really light um and it's cute like i love it i really love it my hairline is still intact i love yani i just i love this hair it's really light honestly so if you're looking for something that is not going to like if you're looking for something that's light especially this heat because it's not bulky it's very very light honestly even when i holy yesterday i was at the gym and i'd maybe call me shikiapaju and it felt like i had nothing on my head i'm not even lying so if you want something light done like if you want something light on your head yeah try this hair at nia salon i'm going to link their page um i'm going to link i put a link on the description and also pin a comment please just check okay i'm going to pin a comment and of course i'm going to write it on the screen go give them a visit and i also got my nails done one thing about me anytime i get my nails done i feel like i have really long fingers and so i avoid putting on long nails like i really avoid putting on long nails because i have a very small a thin nail plate and so um with my long fingers if you put if they if they if i get um if i get my nails done and then they place a wide sorry stick on on my nails it looks funny and i don't like it but this guy the nail tech at near salon did a perfect job honestly if i get anytime i get my nails done i hardly do this if they're not my natural nails i hardly do this because i feel like i don't look nice but i can comfortably do this like take pictures like this like you get <laughs> you get right i can he put the perfect size on my nails and actually i was telling him you're the first and i'm not lying ever since i came to live at a live alone even Nairobi, even in sweden i try and that's why i actually go for a square shape because i feel like it kind of defines my nails it's not focusing um so when he did this i was like you're the first person who's gotten my nail size right i'm not even kidding and it turned out amazing and um this is not even actual the actual color it's a baby pinkish um it's baby pink and then orange on the side at least the orange is showing by showing as if it's red so yeah i love them i really love them tried something new i hardly put on colors like bright colors on my fingers i only go for white red and maybe some shades of brown of which i'm also very very cautious so trying orange luminous orange was a very very big thing for me and not only even not only my nails but also my hair come and see braids <laughs> i mean i'm very i'm very skeptical when it comes to how i look if that makes sense yeah and i also got my toenails done the kawaii white i love it i got my lashes done um at a different salon uh, a different lash parlor um you've already seen it i love how they turn out and one thing about my eyes anytime i get my lashes done the day after i get them done they're always going to be red at the bottom i don't come up yeah they're red they're not itchy it's not itchy but i it's been long since i so it's not even i think i got my lashes done in in november yeah so it's been about december january feb because feb is almost ending three months so this is going to be gone by tomorrow hopefully yeah by the way i'm loving my lashes at least i've got in a lash tech that knows what they're doing hmm? <laughs> anyway um i want to go and take a shower because yesterday i went to the gym i don't know how i said that and my body is on fire i feel so 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 i want to take a hot shower and also show you how i layer my shower gels and everything everything and just do a bit of skincare not skincare but self-care because it's essential and please let me tell you self-care and maintenance day you don't even have to splurge a lot like it can be anything literally can be anything yeah it can be anything i don't want to talk too much because it's already five minutes i'm already five minutes in i don't want to make this um so long so um it's currently 6 or 3 so let me take a shower before it gets dark and then call it a day okay not really call it a day call it a vlog that makes sense.
crown, that's a jam. a toner and a moisturizer but of course i had to do a consultation first so yeah, i like i had to yeah to do a consultation consultation with them before i get the products which i thought was really nice and uh, they recommended that because my skin has really been dry and uh, i've been over exfoliating so it's just been going through a lot to be honest honestly this camera does not capture everything that my face is going through but now it feels so much better it looks so much better than it was on saturday isn't it this is a mosquito actually this place has mosquitoes <laughs> yeah so this is a mosquito whatever but my skin feels so much better than it was on saturday i really can't give like a full on review because i mean i just started using them on saturday but i can attest that there's been some change so i really can't wait to see how my face is going to look like maybe in the next two weeks or so honestly yeah and then i've been using this eye cream from not eye cream but it's a serum eye serum from the ordinary i'm so sure you know this <sighs> i don't know what's wrong with my camera please just cooperate this this is what i've been using um it's the caffeine solution five percent egcg 
I just use a little by then. <laughs> Let me tell you, I don't use it all every day. Like I should. I forget sometimes because it's been long since I had like I don't know, I feel like I'm too bright on that side. Yeah, that's better. It's been long since I had like a proper skincare routine. Like I was on Vaseline. <laughs> anyway, so this is actually I'm I'm impressed. I'm happy and I'm proud of myself that I'm beginning to do what I used to do a long time ago. <laughs> uh, acne can really humble you, to be honest. Acne. Anyway. Yeah, that's how I do it. And then I finish off with this moisturizer that smells like whipped cream. Even better than whipped cream. I can smell so nice. It smells so nice. It reminds me of this candle called Dime. Is it Dime? I love it. I love that candle. So it smells like that. And sometimes I even feel like, <laughs> like it smells good. So good. My eyes are so sensitive, Yanni. See, and it's just red at the bottom. It's crazy. Anyway. And that's it for my skincare. I really can't wait to see how I'm going to look in two weeks, to be honest. I'm so excited. Go through their page and see like their reviews. You're going to love it. You're going to love it. You're giving me wind and rain. You're some kind of butterfly. Something about Dera's, just something about Dera's. This is my mom's Dera, that's why it's like, I mean, I don't know it's okay. But any a Dera is supposed to be an over, an oversized like outfit, yeah. Anyway, um, I'll end this vlog here. I'm sorry it's all over the place, but I hope you've gotten the gist. <laughs> so, um, I'll just go have dinner and uh, edit this vlog, and then I'll see you on my next one um once again i'm going to include not include but i'm going to link near salons page in the description and i'm also going to pin a comment with their handle their contacts and everything else and just go and check their page honestly you're going to find all the information there and let me tell you that salon is just good vibes to the <laughs> good vibes yani that was my first day going there and you'd think I've been there before those people are just too friendly they're very comfortable like they're comfortable to be around and it's just amazing yeah so i'll see you on my next one please just pray for my eyes to go back to normal because this is not normal <laughs> um i'll see you on my next one okay um i love you but god definitely loves you more than you could ever imagine like more than anything in this world nothing actually this verse has been in my heart i think since saturday and it was it says it's romans 8 nothing can separate you from the love of god literally nothing not the angels not the demons nothing can separate you from the love of god okay so god loves you again and he loves you so much i'll see you on my next one bye